sketchbook i did try and go ahead and make like a first page for this or like a cover page but that'll be another video i'm looking forward to actually filling this out though and this is arguably like the most stressful part of starting a sketchbook i think i don't know i hate first pages so much and i am aware that i can just like you know tear some of these out but i really want to like you know do things right the first time on this page. i want the theme to be like very like whimsical almost so i think i'm gonna draw like like something to do with like butterflies maybe i can actually draw some like little ideas right here ignore the stickers i was trying something and it didn't work out but i think on this inside page i can actually say my goals for the sketchbook that'll be fun oh this pen is running out of ink Okay, I don't know how to do cursive and that definitely is not how you write goals in cursive, but we live, we love, we love. I'm gonna go ahead and write these all out like a little checklist maybe. Um, oh wait, I haven't even thought about this yet. Wait, what are my goals? I want to draw more anatomy studies just because I think that I could benefit from them. I still be drawing the most stiff looking people known to man. I'm gonna say more finished illustrations in the sketchbook because i think every time i actually like fit out a sketchbook it's like recently it's been a lot of sketches like i don't actually commit time to make illustrations and i also want to plan art more like before i actually make a page i want to kind of like plan it out which is exactly what i'm going to do for this page i'm going to just do it on this little side panel here I don't know. I wanted to do like something with like butterflies, if that makes sense. Maybe like a character like looking at butterflies or something like that. Not what butterflies look like, but it's okay. And she's like kind of looking at them. Maybe, 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 maybe even holding one. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> or kind of have her like like a, like a side profile or of some sort. And she's like looking at them and she's like, oh, butterflies. That's crazy. Something like that ignore how horrendous that side profile is and then just have little butterflies around her i kind of like that idea more i think i want to do something like that with like a close-up drawing of somebody and then like little butterflies around them i want to give them like little like pointy features if that makes sense like a sharper chin stuff okay so i picked this reference they have a lot of like sharp features, which I thought were really cool. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sketch this without talking because I cannot concentrate whenever I'm blabbing. So I'll get back to you, but I will be like filming my sketching process. Okay, bye. I mean, okay, I'll shut up now. So at this point, I was just like incapable of drawing a good face. I don't know what happened. So I like had to like leave my desk, get a snack. And then I came back and I sketched it off camera. And then lo and behold, the sketch looks much better. Like it had a glow up <laughs> whenever I came back. I think I just needed that break, you know what Even I mean? though I barely started sketching, I guess I needed a break from filming. I don't know. But I went ahead and I started drawing in a hijab for her. This face does not look like the reference photo at all. I can put it on my screen and it's also also on my pinterest so check that out if you really want to but um yeah i wanted to go for sharper features like i said before but it didn't really work out too well for me i've been wanting to like update my pinterest boards but i literally go on pinterest like once a month and it's not very like i don't, I don't get much done i just look at a few artworks and i'm like okay <laughs> that's enough i was really excited for the background i think i really wanted to make her pop with like a darker background if that makes sense so i kind of drew her in like a foresty setting ish i was super scared about lining and coloring this though i was like if i ruin this with the coloring or the line art i'm actually gonna like cry because it looks so good as a sketch And then it was time to draw the butterflies. I don't know about y'all, I suck at drawing butterflies. I could draw them like front facing, like what they taught us in preschool, but I can't do like anything past that. I just can't deal with like bug anatomy, like no. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go ahead and kind of lightly erase this real quick so then I can go in with some markers. What I like to do, I kind of like roughly go over it, but I leave a little bit of the sketch left to kind of differentiate where stuff starts and ends 
And then I think I'll do the background with some paint pens because I don't feel like using my hoo-hoos to fill in the whole thing. Know some people like to start with um, lighter tones and make build their way up. Honestly, it depends on the day for me. Um, I think I'm uh, just to use them like this. Oh, I should use this little thing that they provided me with. I don't know why I was not using that before. Guys, I swear that I meant to talk when I started coloring this, but I literally zoned out and then I didn't talk like at all. So that's kind of embarrassing on my end, but I I'm sorry. I'll, I'll talk now. Sometimes I make these voiceovers and I'm like, do people actually care what I'm saying? <laughs> Like, would they rather just, like, sit in silence with, like, music or something? Because, like, I feel like I'm yapping and it's, like, boring yapping. But actually, don't tell me because I think I would feel sad if I, if, like, I, if I actually was boring about I it. I absolutely adored, like, the colors I used for this so much. Like, I tried to stick with, like, peachy tones, but I blended in some, like, purple and, like, reds in there. And I think it definitely made a difference. I just had so much fun, like, coloring in general this page. I think there are definitely points where I was like, oh, shoot, this is gonna turn out horrible because I, I made, like, a coloring mistake or something. But honestly, it's just part of the process and I think the final just looks so good. Like, I feel so happy about this first page. I think this is actually a very low bar i don't remember very like i don't really like my first pages like ever so i'm happy about this one it, like it plays a good part in like saying what the rest of the sketchbook is gonna look like i also haven't filmed a voiceover in forever that's actually insane like ugh. I miss YouTube, dang. It's been like a month. I filmed this a month ago and I was supposed to post it like the week after that last video. And then I just put off editing, but editing is so fun. I just like forget because it's so tedious to like open the app and sit down and it's on my phone too. So I'll get distracted really easily. <sighs> it's a whole process, but I'm glad that I'm finally getting this out. This new year, I definitely want to make more videos. I think that's like at the top of my resolutions. I just like, I say this every year and then I don't actually, get to it so i really hope that i can push through this year comment down below what your new year's resolutions are i have written some of them down but i also have like my ins and outs list for 2024 it's like a trend that's kind of going around i think on like tiktok but i made my own list so i'm gonna read it out to you because i don't know what else to talk about but some of my ins are being like more disciplined rather than being driven by motivation i think i need to like actually push myself to be disciplined more um because motivation you know like you're not always gonna be motivated but if you have discipline then you're going to be able to achieve your goals um consistently throughout the year or like whatever type of mental space you're in i also want to like actually go to the gym like consistently like sometimes i'll go with a friend but like i'm not doing much like i don't have the proper stamina for gymming i, I want to like get i want to i want to get fit you know what i mean um additionally i want to try more cuisines cuisines cuisine i can't say it. i cannot tell you how bad i want to try mediterranean food like oh my gosh that's not even like that's, that's not like a resolution i just really want to try mediterranean food and like other cuisines that i haven't tried i also before. want to give people like the benefit of the doubt whenever they like wrong me if that makes sense like kind of just be in like a positive mood about like things and look positively think positively and kind of like meditation and self-improvement i'm not good with meditation i can't sit still but i want to like kind of get better at that this coming year like i'll sit down i'll close my eyes i'm ready i'm in like the perfect position you know everything Thing, my eyes are closed and then i'll hear like a notification or i'm like oh how about i need water i need food i'm hungry i want to listen to music and then i don't end up meditating at all and also um i have to start wearing sunscreen like i do not wear sunscreen it just takes so long because the sunscreen that i had it gives you like such a white cast on your face and it annoys me because i have to sit there rubbing it for like three minutes but i know that my skin will love me if i actually wear sunscreen so i think I, I will in the future, okay? Don't- please don't yell at me. Low-key, the past month, it's been stressful. It's been bad. Like, I've broken out so much. I have this huge pimple on my chin right now. It's stressing me out, okay? The pimples are stressing me out further, so I'm getting more pimples. And it's just like- it's just like a cycle. It's a never-ending cycle, and- it annoys me and then for my outs i think screen time i definitely need to lower that especially doom scrolling like it's so bad for my mental health like i'll be so happy like i'll go onto instagram 
Instagram and then I'll look through like a bunch of these reels. But it just gets to a point where you keep scrolling and then you feel really unproductive and like in a rut. I gotta set those like screen time restrictions restrictions on my phone. I like turn off my notifications, I think, but I gotta do that too. I don't have a lot of outs, but the other one is like comparing myself to other people and also feeling bad about like my situation. I think like I need to just like let go of like just let go, you know, let go to the past, let go of anything that's like bringing me down. Um, and then I'll be like, I'll, I'll get happy. But yeah, I'm super excited about this coming year. Um, here I am finishing up the drawing. I decided to go in with this like foresty green color. Um, I didn't um, refill it on purpose because I kind of liked how it looked like kind of streaky. I think it added a lot of dimension to the drawing. And I thought I was done here. I thought I was done with this, but no, no, I was, I had to be extra. This is not where I guess extra, but I've been obsessed with these paint pens and like alcohol markers like combined. Like look at that layering. I think it's probably damaging the marker, but here is where I went crazy. I added yellow and I think it just looks so good like that. Like it just brings out so much like color in the drawing. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I love you so much. Please comment the butterfly emoji if you made it all the way to the end and like and subscribe and hit that bell and ev everything else. I love you so, so much. I'm so proud of you and I hope your new year is full of fun and good memories and self-improvement. Bye.